Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, thanks so much for stopping by. So today we're headed to Costco and we're gonna go look for some products that are keto friendly. Chris's coworker says they have some new items there that we wanna check out. And so that's where we're headed. So come along with us. So it is a beautiful day today. The sun was out, blue sky. I had to go find my sunglasses because we've been having so much cloudy weather and rain lately here in California. Now we're just on our way to Costco and now if you look on the left, those are olive trees and then right in front of that are vineyards where we live and they actually make olive oil and wine from them that we can buy here. So we just got to the Costco, um, the parking lot was not busy at all, there was plenty of parking. It was about 11 o'clock on a Monday. So we're just walking in. It wasn't crowded as you can see. Now this is not keto, but I had to show you guys. These are cognacs from France. They're $100, but they're shaped like a tiger and a dragon. Look at that. Isn't it cool? Just had to show you those. <laughs> Now these are really good. I've gotten them before. They're chicken skewers and they're marinated in like a Greek seasoning. Um, you just heat them up, they're fully cooked. They also have this sliced grass-fed sirloin as well as sliced roasted turkey for some great prices. Super easy to make salads or something with those. Now we got these crepini egg wraps. They're made with egg and cauliflower and we liked them. Now they also have these little packages of meat and cheese that are great to have as snacks. Now I think I showed you this in another video, but they have these keto salted caramel ice cream bars and they're on sale this time and they are amazing. Now we also wanted to try this cauliflower crust pizza. They had um, a meat lovers variety and then they also had a roasted vegetable. Now we tried this for dinner last night and it was excellent. If you didn't know it, you wouldn't know the crust was keto. It had a nice crunch to it, and I would highly recommend that one for sure. Next time I wanna try the roasted vegetable. Now these are interesting. Real Good Foods has these chicken enchiladas, but instead of a tortilla, they use like a flat piece of chicken and wrap it up in shredded chicken. Now they also have these egg sandwiches for breakfast. So instead of a bun, it's the egg on the outside with turkey sausage. So those look good. Now um, I bought this and I'm gonna do a review on it. Keto and Paleo um, brownie mix. And then if you like to use almond flour, hands down, best price, you get this large bag for $10.99. Can't go wrong. Now this was brand new. I hadn't seen it last week, but it's truffle uh, black garlic seasoning. Doesn't it? And, oh, it's Parmesan too. So I wanna try that sometime. So speaking of Parmesan, they have these Parmesan crisps with mixed nuts in them. And then they also have these other kind of Parmesan um, crackers, crisps. Now they had this Franz Keto white bread. Have, have any of you guys tried this? I wanted to get it, but I was afraid to get two big loaves and then we didn't like it. But I really do want to try it. Then they had some more um, cheese crackers, these wisps. I'm finding a lot of keto stuff has um, Parmesan cheese in it. <laughs> now they had these Catalina Crunch cereal which looked good and we bought these they are um, high key mini chocolate chip cookies they are really good so if you see those pick some up they're a little pricey but they were really good then they also have these keto crackers made with different kind of seeds i believe they were gluten free they also had some granola, which looked really good. This, um, it was cinnamon blueberry. So I wanna try that sometime too. Gives all the nutrition on the bottom, which is nice. And then they had the, the trail mix, 
with just nuts and dark chocolate and cocoa. And then this looked really good, Keto Crack. No sugar, it says it's just dark chocolate with nuts. I wanted to get everything, you guys, but it was just too many things. Then they had these no sugar keto bars. Um, half were chocolate and half were peanut butter, but then these looked super good. Um, these were the peanut butter cups, so I'm definitely going to be trying those next time. So that's it, guys. Just wanted to show you a few th keto things that they had at the... Um, Costco. So thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up and we'll see you on the next episode. Bye everybody.